Hello all, this video is on Li-Fi data transmission, data transmission using uh, LEDs, light emitting diodes. A solar panel is used as a receiver in this kit. Uh, the kit is available with uh, alselectro.com, your buy link is given in the description below. Uh, the receiver board is built on 80 mega 8 IC and a comparator uh, LM358 IC is also used on board. Uh, power supply up to uh, 12 volt can be given as 5 volt regulator is on board the 80 mega 8 works on 5 volt and there is a preset on board to adjust the speed of the data received the transmitter is also built on 80 mega 8 IC uh, and a reflector with LED is used as a transmitter this LED is a 12 volt LED the power uh, supply can be provided from 9 to 12 volt a separate power source is required for a transmitter and receiver as this uh, wireless uh, data transmission. The 80 mega 8 IC used on board requires 5 volt which is supplied by the 5 volt regulator on board. So you can safely supply a power source from 9 to 12 volt. The receiver is uh, connected with the solar panel. First we'll start the demo using uh, PC. For this we need a USB to TTL uh, converters uh, built on CP2102. For power source, I'm using a 9 volt battery with uh, uh, with tag and uh, DC connector. As the power consum consumption is very less in milliamps, this 9 volt battery is enough as uh, a power source for both the transmitter as well as receiver. Separate uh, power source is used. The connection between uh, uh, receiver board and USB to TTL is uh, ground to ground rx to tx and uh, tx to rx the same way at the transmitter side we are using another usb to ttl uh, connecting ground to ground uh, tx to rx and rx to tx uh, serial communication in uh, reverse connection connect the first uh, usb to ttl to one usb port of pc and the second one to the another port of uh, usb a port of PC. Open device manager and note down the COM ports allotted. Here uh, COM2 is allotted for my transmitter and COM222 for uh, receiver. We will be using PuTTY uh, serial terminal for testing purpose. Open uh, two instances of uh, PuTTY terminal. At the, on the first PuTTY terminal select serial as uh, COM port 2 and baud rate 9600. This will be used as uh, transmitter. Uh, on the second uh, PuTTY terminal, select COM port as uh, 22, same baud rate uh, 9600 and open the terminal. Now you will see some junk data uh, received as we are not yet uh, set the receiver preset. For testing the transmitter side, uh, you just uh, inside the transmitter window of uh, PuTTY, just type in any character, you can just uh, see the LED flashing on inside the reflector. This is the test for transmitter. And if you place the transmitter over the uh, near the uh, solar panel, you will uh, receive some junk data. Uh, you can place it, place the reflector over the uh, solar panel just for uh, aligning aligning purpose. And then align uh, the preset while typing in the tra transmitter window of PuTTY. S uh, adjust slightly the potentiometer so that the uh, second LED near the power LED uh, goes on and uh, near that point you will get the data, proper data. You have to adjust very carefully, very slowly the preset so that uh, you get uh, steady data. Now let us start the actual demo using Arduino boards. Two Arduino Uno boards required, one for receiver side and another for transmitter side. At the receiver side, we use uh, an I2C LCD for uh, displaying data. This I2C LCD uh, requires only four wires. Uh, the SCL of I2C goes to A5 of Arduino, SDA goes to A4, VCC to 5 volt and ground to ground. And the uh, receiver of uh, Li-Fi connection is ground to ground RX to TX and uh, TX to RX 
use the 9 volt battery as power source for the receiver now the code side open arduino we are using the uh, wire.h library as well as the new i2c lcd library this library can be download uh, the uh, the download link is given in the description below you can unzip it and uh, rename it as uh, new uh, liquid crystal open the uh, program files and Arduino under library you just uh, paste this new library already a library a old library for liquid crystal is uh, uh, existing uh, this is uh, so this is named as new liquid crystal paste this library And inside the uh, and inside the code, we use uh, new. We create a new object I2C object with the uh, with the address I2C address of the LCD. This address can be found using this uh, by using this uh, I2C scan code. You can upload this uh, code onto Arduino with the I2C display connected and you can find the i2c address of the lcd use this uh, address inside code and upload the code onto the arduino at the transmitter side we are using a potentiometer to transmit uh, analog data the potentiometer center pin is connected to a2 1 and 2 power source vcc and other into ground the connection between transmitter and li-fi to arduino is uh, tx to rx rx to tx and ground to ground Another 9 volt battery is uh, connected to as a power source for transmitter. The transmitter code is very simple. We are just defining the A2 pin, uh, analog pin, and then uh, transmit the data, read the serial uh, data at A2 and transmit it uh, at regular intervals. You can see the uh, reflector flashing according to the transmit data. You can place the reflector near the uh, solar panel, receiver solar panel, and you can see the display on the I2C LCD. You can also adjust the preset on the, on the back of the I2C LCD to get the data. You can focus the transmit reflector uh, facing the solar panel and then adjust the potentiometer from the transmitter to get the data on I2C LCD. While you uh, change the potentiometer, the value is uh, reflected using LED and the solar panel receives the data and displays uh, it on the I2C LCD. A maximum distance of 30 cm is effective using this uh, Li-Fi uh, kit. And even during daylight, this uh, data transmission is effective. The wireless transmission is effective. Huge data is not possible like uh, video transmission. But for basic uh, data transmission, it is uh, more effective. Uh, using a light emitting diet, wireless transmission is possible. Thank you for watching.